Hello and welcome to Cracking the Cryptic. Uh, now, I've heard that there's going to be today a show on HBO Real Sports. Today's edition is going to feature something on the US Puzzle Championships, the crossword tournament. So, um, sorry, the US, the ACPT. So, I thought in honour of that, um, I'd have a look at... In that show, real sports. I think they'll be showing some real stars if they if they show anybody competing, and we'll see why they are real stars. I'm going to put myself through trying to solve last Saturday's um, New York Times crossword puzzle, and this is the puzzle published regularly that is closest to the level of difficulty of a final puzzle at the uh, the ACPT. So hopefully. I think the ACPT save up a particularly hard one, so I may be able to get away without one that's all that hard, but often the difficulty of the clearing and, to some extent, the Americanness of the references can uh, tell against me, so we'll see how we go. It could be a long blank period at the start. Geological feature is Zion National Park. Rock arches? No, I don't know. On base. No carousel music. Contents of some dollies. Corn dollies? Is that worth a shot? Might be. Does 19 end in an N? And, and, and in France. A's, I suppose. Plural of and in France. Stalls alongside the road. That the question mark says not quite what it means. So that may be kiosks or booths of some sort. Slide upward curves. Ah, oh, voice actor Hank. That must be Hank Azaria from The Simpsons. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong, Hank. Uh, join, meld, weld. Fine and dandy in old slang. Blathered on and on. Wow. Has that Z any help? Toy that's a type of vortex cannon. Not to me. Oh, a howitzer. Z would be in the right place if there was an ending added onto that. Arches doesn't work now. So, not a lot. A Scottish hillside. Okay, that's in my wheelhouse of Bray, Senate Majority Leader after Frist. That's not easy for a non-US, probably not easy for a US person, but slight upward curves. Cambers, I thought they were downward curves, but must curve up from the other side. Org based near Colorado Springs. And I mean, org means it's an abbreviation. Join fuse? Could be. There's quite a lot of words meaning join. Stalls alongside the road. It looks like a market now. Let's try that. Seven down. No, eight. Join with a K. -E. For, oh, yoke. If you yoke something together, you join it. I mean, these aren't. Canyon, some sort of canyon, and a bazooka, some sort of bazooka. Well, now that's nice, but how am I ever going to get the beginnings of these words? Some sort of canyon, some sort of bazooka, some sort of market, flea market. Let's risk it. On base can be safe and baseball talk. Carousel music, lilt. That makes it an air bazooka. Contents of some doily dollies. Or was I suppose a dolly could be it could be one of those trams on train tracks. To be arranged. Slot canyon. Might be. I'm not probably gonna get a better answer. N O R A. I don't know what that is so I'm going to have to at some point guess at the, a surname when I've got the first letter of 23 down, 10 down, blathered on, on that. Okay. Be in danger of falling, totter or teeter. 
let's try it out here and see if it works. River of Central Germany is probably the odor, although the elbow would fit as well if it was in the yeah, concern is care. Okay, so we've got it right. Common bait for fishing, probably red something. Sizes up rates, maybe. Not certain. Flings, casts. Might be thinking too. English crossroads off the wall. Mm. Sport featuring the egg beater kick. Let's try water polo. Fit. Never heard of the egg beater, obviously. Checked out before going in. Cased the joint. Um, guessed right. Guessed right. Off the wall. Wacky. 40 cross fraternal club. I think the Elks. I keep coming across them in crosswords. Not something I know about. Emeritus means retired. Parts of research papers. Abstracts. Could be some other tracts. Guessed right, called it. That's quite American too. 42, with skill, adeptly. Nice. Proper word. Walked confidently, strode. Okay, this is going okay. Yeah. Half of a stock market index name. Dow Jones? Doesn't f oh, there are others. I should know those easily. Fruits also known as bottled goods. There's some sort of melon, isn't it? Um, Inopportunity, inopportunity, at a bad, inopportunely, I can't pronounce it, at a bad time, probably, mega seller, and pay, remit, yeah, read, must be, and that is the most likely name, and NORAD actually rings a bit of a bell, ham, go with, camera? Is that like, because hams act up for the camera? Atoms, smithereen. Activist Guinier, I'm sorry, Mr. or Mrs. Guinier, I don't know. Diamond Club. I don't even know what that means. 50. Cheery Cry, higher. Title meaning commander, Emir or Amir. Let's go with Emir now. Although actually all those A's suggest probably not right. Firms, sets, standard and pours, obviously. Cheery cry, hi-ho. Yeah, hi something, because this is now Calabash's roots. Okay. So it must be a camera, and it must be a monster. Lani Guinea, the bat is a diamond club. That's, oh, diamond, baseball diamond again. Mega seller is a monster hit. Okay, so what's I heard? 51, gang up on in a way. I'm not convinced, but all right. Coke and Pepsi have had many of them. Taste tests? That would have a lot of useful words. A lot of useful letters at the end. 52 with a P. Novel ideas. Mm. No, plots, ideas for novels, probably. 35, butcher's cut, loin. Good crossword word, lots of vowels. Words to live by, motto. What's the motto with you? Situated beneath the earth's surface. Don't know. Where couples may be seen kissing. Oh, some sort of booth? You see, this is American culture, I don't know. There is a kissing booth, but it must have some other name. Corporate, military, and business leaders. That's some sort of elite, but again, I don't know the phrase. One making deposits in a bank. Not obvious. Foundation bid. So it's a donor, so it's probably a sperm donor, could have been a blood donor. Red worm, I suppose. Yes, okay. Couples might be seen kissing in a photo booth. Okay, maybe. Pandora and others. I only know Pandora is the owner of a box. 
Ah, 16. Word with coffee or sh gift shop, I suppose. ES something. Game can lead a producer to Yahtzee and Bingo. And what is this? Lots. Oh my god, it is Teeter. There is another river, the Ada. So this is a slew of things. There's lots. Pandora must be an app that I should probably know and don't. And that must be a power elite. Okay, I'm more confident than about Slot Canyon, but not much. Now, eight down. Most easy to walk on. <sighs> Situated beneath the Earth's surface. What's that? Doesn't look how I would expect that to look at all. Some deer. Can't be elks again. Rose or does. I haven't the foggiest, let's go with no idea, because that will fit with rose or does. So beneath the surface must be nether. Me kissed, easiest to walk on. Oh. So D or R here, one who acts without thinking. Reactor, dark beer. Beer holder, mug. Maybe a mug. Up, gang up on in a way, decide. I'm not convinced, but all right. I guess something. Uh, okay, so Coke and Pepsi. Oh, okay, not idea, not no idea. Try no clue, and that gives us better animals. Now I quite like taste tests, and let's risk it. Um, 46, dark beer. Bock, I'm thinking, might be a beer. So one who acts without thinking about a robot. Gang up on, it must be double something, so of a piece. If you say so, I'm going to have to do, <coughs> it must be Thai from Taekwondo. <coughs> the car from the southernmost part of the US Route 1, around 90 degrees, is that west or east then? East, and the beer hole is a keg. It's like G something else. That's the Florida Keys. Double T getting up on. One letter buys and bock. Let's hope we get the right answer from that. Yeah, there we go. And that's quite a straightforward for a Saturday puzzle, and it still took me 12 minutes, and there's so much stuff there. This one particularly featured were phrases where I might have heard them before, but not in the top. Slot Canyon and Air Bazooka. I didn't know those phrases. However, I know Photo Booth, Sperm Donor, Double Team, if you say so. Taste tests, yeah. Calabashes, you sort of. Monster hit at a bad time. Some of these are phrases that wouldn't make a British crossword because they're not fixed in dictionaries, so they're kind of in the language, and apparently that's what appeals about American crosswords. So um, it's certainly nice for the puzzle, but it makes it quite hard when you're coming at it with from an angle where you expect only classic words like abstracts and adeptly to make answers. So um, great fun. I mean, really well put together puzzle, and uh, greatly enjoyed it. So I hope the uh, Real Sports takes crosswords seriously for however briefly it treats them, and uh, it'll be interesting to uh, catch up and find out. Good to have a chance to do a US puzzle, and I uh, hope you see you again on Cracking the Cryptic. Bye now.